Luckily, we're all-wheel drive, I think. Oh, boy. I broke the trailer, but luckily I didn't break the truck, so we're fine. Keep going. <laughs> Alrighty, hello guys, welcome you faces back to another Stormworks video. Today we are checking out this thing, which is a 2000 Freightliner, Argosy, Argosy? <laughs> Dude, I can't say that. Um, this thing, it's a truck. Um, and also, it's a sleeper truck, so if we jump inside, and we have a quick little look in the back, there is a bed, and also a TV, and also a bunch of things, uh, which is pretty cool. Um, but what we're gonna do today is a mission that we haven't actually successfully done before and that is Hold on. Let's have a little look right here transport equipment to the mine uh, And we're gonna be using this lorry because it seems like a good idea uh, Let's go ahead and close this door real quick and just make sure that we can open the back doors because if we can't that would suck uh, How do we open them here we go doors? Boop. Oh wow. Whoa, okay. That's weird looking. Let's close those uh, but we do actually have room in the back to put stuff inside, so awesome, we'll use it. Now just to figure out which side the steering wheel's on, because I can't remember, it is on the left, alright, it's on the wrong side, but that's okay. Uh, we got beams, we got a horn, we got left blinker, right blinker, we got the door, we've got high speed safety steering, we should probably just turn that on anyway. Uh, cruise control, we've got packing brake, alright, okay, but to turn this thing on, it's on the left side. Okay, right. It's on. Okay, so we just drive. Is that it? That's easy. Alright, off we go. It's an automatic, which is awesome. And yeah, off we go. Alright, so we gotta drive three kilometers to begin with. Um, just down to the dock, I believe. Okay, we broke it. We broke it already. Let's get a new one. <laughs> Let's get a new one. Okay, so yeah, we're driving from here down to the dock. And then from the dock, we're driving to the mine. So... Uh, if we can get there without dying, that would be awesome. Uh, lane assist hold, we got auto blinkers. Which would be quite useful, I suppose, because we, we're not going to use them. So auto blinkers are on. Beautiful. Keep us going. Great. Alright, stay in a straight line. Good. We got a horn, which sounds different. We got some beams, which is our lights. And we got cruise control, which we're going to flick on because we're going 77. Which seems like a decent speed. Yeah, this seems like a legit speed to be doing this. Um, so, yeah, I'm quite happy with this so far. Uh, we're going to go ahead and turn that off for corners because this is a corner. And we don't want to demolish our truck. So I'm not even not even accelerating around there. Dude, it looks beautiful though. Um, okay, right, yep. So we have tried this before actually once uh, with Endo. Uh, where we had a, a plane. We were trying to do it with a plane, but the plane ended up breaking, and Endo ended up dying, I think. Something like that happened. Anyway, um, but yeah. So, this time, we're doing it with a truck, which seems a lot more sensible. Yeah. Okay, we are still driving. Uh, it appears to take quite a while to get to anywhere, going 70 miles an hour, or kilometers an hour, actually. Uh, wait, yeah, kilometers an hour. Um, so, yeah, it takes a while. We do have a radio in here though, which is nice. Uh, we got passenger lights, we got driver's lights. Uh, we've also got interior lights, which is illegal to drive with, I think. Uh, we got a TV. Oh, no way. Right, I'm gonna have to, have to turn that off because that'll distract me. Um, I don't know whether anyone's old enough <laughs> to, to have ever seen that before, um, but that is, that is magic right there. You just have to wait until it hits a corner, like it just did. It hit a corner. Yeah, oh dude. That's awesome. How have you programmed that in? That's that's amazing. Right, turn that off. It's distracting. Um, but yeah. Oh, boy. Wait, have we got something that's like... Oh, beeping? Something keeps beeping every time it looks like we're going to crash. That might be like a crash sensor. That makes sense. Uh, engine temperature. We got voltage. We got fuel. Uh, what else we got? An odometer. Okay. And we got tail... Uh, tra tra trailer air pressure. Which is fine. That's okay. So... We're going to go down onto the dock and load up all of the stuff into the back. And then we got to figure out how to get to there, which is just a just a normal road. All right, cool. It's like playing Euro Truck Simulator. Here we go. Right, so we got a really tight turn coming up here. Here we go. Do a turn. Oh, dude, that is a very tight turn. We can't make that. Look at that. Oh, boy. Do we have, like, uh, the hard steering on? No, we don't. We don't even have the hard steering on. And we still, we still missed that turn. 
Anyway, uh, keep it going. We're at the dock already. So we just got to drive down there, uh, throw all the stuff in the back, and um, see if we can get back up this ramp. Because I'm not so sure it will. I don't know what kind of clearance we've got here, but... Uh... None. I mean, the trailer doesn't have any. If you guys saw what just happened there, we beached it. Um, but it's actually fine. Yep, yeah, the back end of the trailer has also hit the bottom. That's okay. Right, if we can turn around a big circle, throw all the stuff in the back, that would be perfect. But actually, we... The steering! I, I can't steer. I legit can't turn around. I don't know whether we're going to be able to get out of here. But I'll try. Alright, cool. Uh, let's just park it... Straight forwards. So the back sort of matches up. Good. Put on the parking brake if we've got one. I think it's already on. Cool. Parking brake. Oh, there we go. Good. And get out. Yeah. All right, cool. Fill up the back and then let's get going. Okay, back doors are opening. There we go. Do we have to take these? I think we do. Throw them in. There we go. Do we have to take this? I think we do. Throw it in. There we go. We can literally just chuck it all in, which took forever last time. Because we parked our plane miles away. Because uh, it was a plane. And, um, yeah, that's a thing. Alright, just keep chucking these things in. That's fine, don't worry. Just pop them in, one at a time. This thing will go miles, hopefully. Yep, there we go, beautiful. Uh, this thing, and I think the final thing is this. Yeah, that's it. That's all we have to take. Awesome, right. So, put all the stuff in the back of the truck. Close the doors. And now we're going to have to reverse up and drive up there, which I don't know whether it's going to be able to do it. Okay, right. Get back in the lorry. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Here we go. Close the door. Uh, turn the parking brake off. Put it in reverse, which we are in reverse. Beautiful. It beeps when you're in reverse. Oh, I see. The beeping is the indicator. That makes sense. Or the blinkers if you're American. If you're American. All right, cool. Now forwards. Good. Turn off the high-speed steering, because we need it to be relatively useful. <laughs> Alright, brake a bit. Yeah, we don't want to brake anything. Luckily, we're all-wheel drive, I think. Oh, boy. I broke the trailer, but luckily I didn't break the truck, so we're fine. Keep going. <laughs> nice. How fast does this go? Let's go at, like, 80. Oh, dude. Dude, 80 is... Oh, 80 is a bit harsh for this thing. It is. It's a bit harsh. Let's get to 70 again. And, um, yeah, we'll continue all the way there. And this should be a delivery. Easy peasy. All right, cruise control on. Going 73. Awesome. <laughs> we did damage it a lot, but that doesn't matter. That's fine. Let's just keep going. Right, so we're actually at the village. Oh, dude, I can't remember what this place... Oh, dude, I thought we were going to tip over there. I did. I thought we were going to tip over. What's this place called? Halt Town. Yeah, it's called Halt Town. Um, and there appears to be some sort of farm thing going on. But that's the only place where farm things are going on. Anywhere on this planet. Um, yeah, that's literally the only place where you see farm fields. Or fields that are farms or something. Yeah, that right there. Bit weird. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, I've never seen these buildings before, so we'll just we'll just carry on through. Don't mind me. We'll keep going. I oh dude, um, where I don't know what video it was where I used something and we went up like this really massive hill. Um, it was a plane or something. I can't remember what it was. Anyway, we saw this massive hill. Um, and I wonder how this would deal with it. Wait, I don't know which way we go. We gotta go to the right. All right, okay. I know which way we're going now. We go to the right. Yeah, there was a massive hill somewhere. Um, but there's no mission to go around there in a truck. So, maybe when there's an update with missions, uh, we'll be able to go up there. That'd be cool. Finally a bridge! Finally! Yes! Alright, quickly. Go as fast as you can over the bridge. Because that seemed like a good idea at the time, but my trailer didn't like that. Not at all. Um... Keep going. How fast are we going? 132. We don't have high speed steering on. Uh, which we should. We should definitely have that on. Because we're almost there. We don't want to ruin it now. I can't turn. I can't actually steer at all with this turning on. Alright, okay. We're fine. Don't worry. Everything's okay. Do we have to drop it off? Like, do I have to empty my trailer here? Also, is there any roads in? 
Like, there's this road, but it ends. It just stops. Where this light is. There's two lights. Oh, do we follow the lights in? Oh, this is cool, actually. I've never noticed these lights before. So we follow these. This is the road. The road does appear to end here. Unless we go, like, hard... Ah. Oh. You can still make it, truck. You can... I believe. I believe in you. Um... Dude, that's gone up there. Uh... Fine, don't worry. Keep going, truck. I believe in you. Keep going. Floor it. Yes. Oh, we're going to be able to do the mission. Oh, we can't turn left. We can't steer. I'm trying to turn left. It's not really working. Um... I mean, as long as we go downhill this way, I'm sure it's fine. Come on. Come on, you lovely truck. Uh-oh. We, we set it on fire a bit more. Uh... Yep, keep going. Keep going. Keep it going. Come on. Come on, come on. We're so close. We're so close. Yet so far away. Come on. Floor it. I can't get around that. I can't get around it. I, I don't have steering. Oh. Oh, we're doing it. Watch out. Whoops. Sorry. We delivered it. We did it. Yes! Fantastic! So there we go. We delivered it. We delivered all the stuff. Now, uh, if we wanted to and if things worked... Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna spawn a new one so you guys can actually see what's on this thing. Um, we're gonna have a quick little look around before we finish. So, uh, the trailer has legs, uh, which I did notice you could probably put down, I think? Yeah, if we do this, we can put the supports down, which are the legs. Good. We can detach the pin. The king pin. There we go. Uh, it does take a while. And then we should be able to drive out of here, so we'll move forwards uh, and have a little look when we've moved. So, ignition on, move forwards a tiny bit, and there we go, brake. Good. So, we've got the trailer. The trailer is made of gyros, because gyros are very light. Um, if we have a little look at the back of this, we've got a electrical connector. We've got some weird things coming out of here. Dude, the, the speaker looks really good there. Um, and we get some motors and random things. Uh, that looks pretty cool. This whole thing looks pretty cool. Uh, if we move on the inside, obviously inside the cab, we've got a TV above us. A screen that shows our battery, our engine RPM, and our fuel. Alright, cool. And we've got a custom speed hold. That's pretty good. Um, then we got interior lights, of course. So I can turn mine off. We've got a passenger light. We've got a driver's light. Awesome. Uh, we've got a stereo. We got storage, which is underneath the bed. That's really cool. Uh, we got bed, which is above us. Yep, we got upper lights, we got lower lights, and we've got a heater, which is perfect. As well as a, a TV. <laughs> That's awesome. So, that is actually everything in here, I believe. We get a clock as well if we need it. Um, but yeah, I think that's everything. If you guys want to use this thing, um, it is useful for that one mission, uh, but not really useful for anything else. But it is built really well, so that's nice. Um, you guys can go ahead and use it. I'll link it down below, and um, you can use it for yourself. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.